Hey you guys, it's Peter, and welcome to my channel, Peter, that's me, boom, 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 bam, 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 review stuff, <laughs> and I'm in the kitchen, and you're in the cabinet, and someone's in the kitchen with Dinah, someone's in the kitchen, they should have given me a Tony Award, don't you think, I think so, for Peter's in the kitchen, someone's in the kitchen with Peter, Someone's in the kitchen, I know, oh, 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 and it's Boo Radley, Boo Radley. Can you see Boo Radley? Hi, Boo Radley. He's walking right back there. So anyway, how are you guys doing? <laughs> it's Peter, and um, I'm back for another review. Now, I just filmed a video over on my Peter Does Stuff channel. I made these delicious little Sammies, <laughs> these little sandwiches, and um, I did a cooking with Peter video over on my Peter Does Stuff channel. So if you want to see me cook, okay, a full course meal with dessert and everything inside, then go over to my Peter Dove stuff channel. It was a lot of fun. But I was cleaning up and I was putting stuff away and I saw this creamer that I had purchased on, I think it was Sunday when I went to Fresh Time. And my husband and I went to brunch and then he always takes me to the grocery and Fresh Time and things like that. Well, the Fresh Time is a grocery, but takes me to like a normal grocery store where you can get things that aren't Whole Foods. And then he also takes me to Fresh Time. So at Fresh Time, I have been purchasing um, my iced coffee. Now, if you don't watch my Peter Does Stuff channel, I did a whole video over there making my world's fame, my world famous iced coffee. And I'm gonna kinda imitate it a little bit here to you today, but it's gonna be quicker than that. So, I am not going to Starbucks or Dunkin' Donuts on a regular basis. So, sitting at home, filming videos, talking to my neighbors out on the front porch, I like to have an iced coffee. I have started buying some of these canned coffees and trying these. I will tell you, this Colombre coffee, I have not, now I have purchased it like in this big type, but I haven't had this one. So tomorrow I'm going to try this one. I'll let y'all know, okay? But this one right here, which is called High Brew Cat a Coffee, Cold Brew Mexican Vanilla, is like one of my favorites. It's absolutely one of my favorites. And if you have a fresh time in your area, they have the nitro brews, they have the cold brews. They're just delicious, all of them. And I love these that come in like a little can like this. It just, it seems like just enough for me. <laughs> As you can see, I just need enough. <laughs> so anyway, but when I make my coffee at home in my beautiful plastic <laughs> um, crystal cut glasses that I got off of Amazon, okay, don't be jealous, you can get them too. Um, I use a stevia and a creamer. Now what I typically do is I put a stevia in here first, okay, I'm going to show you. <laughs> As if you don't know how a stevia, or sweet and low or whatever, but I heard stevia is the best for you. Okay, so I put a stevia in the glass bottom. And then I usually put creamer. Now, I will tell you, I have tried chai creamer. Chai, well, all of them are oat milk because right now I'm on like this oat milk obsession. I love oat milk. I love it more than anything in the world, okay? Except for romanticals <laughs> or naps or TV shows. I mean, I guess there's a lot of things that come before oat milk, but I really do love oat milk a lot. I really do, okay? So anyway, most of, almost all of the things, I think all of the creamers that I've been purchasing lately are oat milk. And, um, oh no, no. <laughs> I looked down at the one, I was, it's almond milk, and I'm like, well, that's not true. Okay, so this one is Nut Pods. I love Nut Pods. <laughs> And this is the brand I've been using lately, but this is uh, almond and coconut creamer. It's absolutely delicious, but it just tastes like a, a plain creamer to me. So I wanted to try something different. And so when I was at Fresh Time, I found this Elmhurst. This is a brand, and it is oat milk creamer pistachio cream. Okay. Now, I have to tell you. I'm not a big pistachio flavored person. I like to just eat pistachio nuts and just like crack them open and eat them. But I'm not a big like pistachio cream, like or a pistachio person. Like I wouldn't eat like a pistachio nut pie. Do they even make those? I don't even know. Okay. I, hell, I thought this was oat milk and it was almond. So, but I wouldn't, you know, like just out of go out and buy something pistachio, but there were not many flavored ones and it was like hazelnut and I'm not a huge hazelnut fan and it was like cinnamon and I like cinnamon, but more in the fall. And so I wanted to try something different. So I am going to, I need a little stir. This is my straw, my favorite straw of the moment. It is this blue glass straw that somebody sent me. Oh, by the way, I want to show you. My favorite ice, ice cream treat for this summer is these Haagen-Dazs Dolce de Leche Churro 
bars. <laughs> you guys, they're literally unbelievable, okay? If you have one, you'll have to have three. I'm just telling you. Okay, so then on top, uh, before I put the coffee in, on top of the stevia, I put the oat milk or I put the almond milk or whatever have you. I put that in there and um, I put, I don't know, just, I don't measure it really. I just am kind of like, okay, that's enough. What's interesting is, typically I am not a big like coffee, like creamer. Like I'm not somebody that loves like creamer in my coffee. Now I have to tell you, I have been getting when you can buy the big like coffee of this i've been getting the calambre coffee the blonde roast and i've been getting the starbucks the medium and the blonde roast the bl blonde roast used to be my favorite of this but recently i've been getting this is the blonde roast <laughs> i have so many of these in there y'all i should have prepared a little bit better for this video but recently i've been drinking the medium roast because it's a little stronger and i like it more so okay then i pour the coffee so about there well this is almost done so let's just let's just finish her off okay then I mix it with the straw and then I put ice cubes in it and I have ice cubes right here And I just fill it to the top. And there is my iced coffee. Here, let's get a th thumbnail. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna try this. Well, let me tell you the nutritional facts first. I already told you it's 15 calories. So don't ask that again, but it's 15 calories. 0.5 grams of fat, two total carbs. Did I already do this? I feel like I already did this. T uh, one total sugar and zero protein. So pretty healthy. Okay. Cheers, bottoms up. Oh, it's not bad. I actually really like it. There is something about it, this is gonna sound so strange. There's something about it that's rather summery. Um, I mean, it's definitely a pistachio. It tastes like pistachio mint, does it say that? Pistachio cream. It tastes, maybe it's because I think I said like in my vlog that I bought pistachio mint. There's something, I mean, pistachio tastes a little minty sometimes anyway, but it definitely, this ear of mine is like clogged. I just noticed that. There's something minty about it, but it's not like a peppermint. It's not like a mint mint. It tastes like pistachio mint, if that makes sense. Is there like a pistachio mint ice cream? That's kind of what this tastes like. Um, actually, you know what this tastes like? This is gonna sound so strange, and I don't even know how I remember this, being that I've been sober for 27 and a half years. But this kind of tastes like Bailey's and coffee to me. Like on ice is what it tastes like. Yeah, that's a lot of what it tastes like. It tastes like a Bailey's. Like if you ever like Bailey's in your coffee, which I really didn't, but so it's kind of surprising that I like this, but there's something summery about this. I'm gonna give it a four out of five. I really like it. Would I buy this again if I were just given the option of this wonderful almond milk <laughs> over this? I don't know. I mean, I like to have a variety in the refrigerator so I can make different kinds of coffees and stuff. and. You know, but yeah, I think I probably would. I think I would buy it again. Anyway, um, and I really like this brand, this Elmhurst brand. I've, I've purchased them, I think, before. Um, oh, oh, <laughs> oh my Lord. Oh, well, <laughs> just rub it in. <laughs> anyway, let me know what you think in the comment section below. I love you guys and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.